Hey there guys, Frankomatic here, and uh, if you watch the Nintendo World Championships, you might remember that one of the rounds was a balloon trip. Three minutes, see who can get the best score in three minutes. And the top score was something in the range of 12,300. It's been a few years since I've done a balloon trip, but I feel like I can probably do a better job than that. Let's find out, shall we? Got my handy dandy stopwatch here. App lent to me by Sess. So I'm going to start up the timer, and here we go. Now, there is a little trick that I cannot do. I've tried many times in the past. If you can get, I think it's 20 balloons in a row without missing a single one, they all become orange and worth more points. The best way to do that is to get all those balloons in that starting area where everything is set. But I'm not very good at that. As you may have just noticed, well, And that's a minute of my time down, almost. Good going. You know, I was hoping I'd still have the skills to survive the full three minutes. Nope, too slow. There's a very definite path to getting all those balloons. It's very easy to screw it up. Okay, minute and a half to go. Just gotta keep it cool, keep it cool. Not really keeping it cool. Okay. Now the tricky part. <laughs> Where everything just starts going every fucking which way. Low is not where you want to be usually. That fish, and I've done it! I have beaten the five people. in that elimination round. 30 seconds to spare, even! Just think, if I would've actually stayed alive, I would've beat the top score in the three minutes, but... I guess we'll just have to go with this. To be fair, a lot of those people probably have never freaking played Balloon Trip. That's no excuse, this game isn't that hard. And... three... two... one... There we go, three minutes, 18,000 points. Clearly I should have been invited to this, just for the balloon fight round. Anyways, I'm honestly uh, pretty pleased with myself. Later.